Good morning, it's 8.30 in the morning. I'm on my business trip in Shanghai right now. I'm going to have my breakfast before work. Let's go! The restaurant in the hotel is quite decent and it does offer quite some breakfast options including western style and Chinese style like this. It's more than good enough for me. Let's grab a seat and quickly have some. Okay, I'm done and I'm gonna take a cab to the office now. It's winter in Shanghai right now and to me, the weather is pretty nice. Okay, um, I'm reaching to the office. This is the office area and I'm gonna start working. As you can see, Shanghai office has way more people than Singapore. We have to squeeze in to the leave every single morning or even during lunch and dinner time. For those who don't know, I'm actually a machine learning engineer in TikTok. And this is me when I'm working. Instead of watching me work for the next few hours, I will bring you to the lunch. Let's go. In Shanghai office, there are really a lot of choices for food. There are more than 4 or 5 canteens in the office area and easily over 10 to 20 different food options. Basically, most of them are Chinese cuisine. So today, I'm going to have a roasted duck and char siu rice. And these are the foods that I tried the other days. Most of the office desks are adjustable. So I prefer to stand for a while after having lunch. And then I will work for another 3 to 4 hours before having a break. Since this is a vlog, then I will shorten my working time here in this video and show you around. Let's go to the outdoor now. There are around 4 big buildings here for Baidan office. Sometimes, there will be some activities going on in the outside area. It's nice to have a rest after long working hours and walk around here. And I will go for a coffee. Find a Xiangchao Fengwei Nathian. I will consider this coffee is not cheap. It's around 38 Chinese yuan, which is 7 Singapore dollars. I can get a Starbucks by this price as well. Anyway, I'm okay to give a try. It's not bad after all. After a 15 minutes walk, I'm back to office, grab some afternoon snacks and continue working. By the way, let me show you. There's a vending machine in the office and it's all free. You can get the mouse, keyboard and a laptop stand. But of course you have to scan your ID before get it in case you get it every single time. Just right after a few hours, it's time for dinner. As I mentioned in the last video, in China, the company actually provides three meals a day, including dinner. I'm going for noodles today. It was a quick meal and I'm back to my seat to wrap up my daily job before I back to hotel. For some of the colleagues, they will be back around this time after having dinner. I usually leave around 9pm when I was in Shanghai and it's time to go. Again, it is freezing at night. I think it is around 3 to 4 degrees Celsius during that time and I'm calling a cab back to my hotel. Yeah, I finished my day and this is how it looks when I was in business trip in Shanghai. See you then. Bye.